You know, once there was a time that kids used to play outside. And what we used to do outside is shoot each other for fun. And so when I turned eight, I got my first Nerf gun for my birthday. And what I will try and do in this video is, well, first find that gun and make it look cool again. So <laughs> I can go shoot my friends once more. I think I've already found it. So there are a lot of guns. Let's open the window real quick. But the gun there in the back, that is my old gun, which is now over 10 years old. I believe we lost the original magazine. It could only hold like six darts. I'm not a very tall guy. I never have been. Uh, and this, well, this weapon is quite big. And so you can imagine that when I first got this 10 years ago, I could barely hold it. It was way too big for me. So I hope that at the end of this video, this gun is gonna look as real as it possibly can. But now first I wanna try if I can find some of the pictures of me with this gun when I was about eight. These crocs, army colors, this back. Army colors. I told you I was a soldier. Ooh, this is starting to look like it. You see that? And my brother as well. He was always a better soldier than I was. <laughs> That's me. I look like a fucking plant. I just found a photo from me and a Nerf gun. But it is not my first Nerf gun. It's my second Nerf gun. <laughs> this is amazing. What the hell? I haven't actually found the photo I was looking for yet, but I think you get the point. Since this was my first Nerf gun ever, I'm gonna make it look as cool as I possibly can. And how I'm planning to actually pull that off is by uh, modifying it a whole lot. Clearly, the yellow color has to go. First, I thought I wanted to make it black and white and make it sort of a stormtrooper look, but now I've decided just to go completely black. So the first thing we will have to buy is paint. Not black, it says on here. So I'm just gonna order this one. So now we're gonna have to go search for the more fun stuff, like attachments, stocks, magazine, things like that. What do we have here? I'm trying to decide between just one of these, which is 14 bucks, or, or this set, which is a little bit more expensive, but then I have a clear one uh, for free. I'm gonna go for this one after all. I think I have just found something else I'm gonna need, and that is a stock. Uh -huh. This is more difficult than I thought it would be. Order that one as well. Yeah, I'm just gonna get this one. It is not expensive at all. Oh, what? It is expensive. Oh, yeah. This one is uh, quite cheap and looks cool. Oh, and I like this stock way better. But how much more expensive is it? <sighs> you know, all of this stuff adds up. One of these parts alone, not that expensive, but all of them together. Ooh. So the whole cost of this project with shipping included was 71 euros and three cents. One part of the puzzle has actually already arrived, so I'll just quickly go get it. Two of these matte black spray paints. And now it's time to put these two to the test. The plan was to first take the gun apart and then paint it, but there was just one screw I just couldn't get to loosen, so I decided to not take the gun apart at all. Three weeks after I ordered my magazine, they thought it would be time to tell me that they didn't actually have it in stock, so well, that kind of sucked. I went out and bought another one, and here we are another two weeks later. So let's finally unbox all of these parts and put the whole gun together. There we have it, ladies and gents. I now have this amazing looking gun and that got me thinking, is there someone I really need to shoot? Yes, there is. I'm coming for you, little brother. Oh, every time, no man, down is in my teeth, I got 
a lot of shine Running up the numbers, that's a lot of crime Take it from me, must be at your mind. Are you looking for me? How do you know that? Eh. <laughs>